Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> um, hello YouTube, hello everyone. Welcome back and today I'm just coming in here to talk about a to talk about Gucci. not Gucci really, but similar to Gucci, but it's regarding Tony Bianco. It's a it's an Australian brand and specifically I'm reviewing this um Vienna loafers, which is sort of like a Gucci dupe, but yeah, um, I got this um, loafers or mules like almost no, not a year, probably six, nine months, nine months ago, and I've just used it non stop. That's why I'm just in here to share this with you with my experience because I, I am drawn to the Gucci loafers, um, to the mules, but. I'm not ready to like pull the trigger yet. I did buy this with that intention of like trying out if I if it's gonna work for my lifestyle, but of course it did if it did actually. But yeah, we'll start off by like telling you about the price point of this specific um, shoe. This one retails does it come in there? But it retails for 149 Australian dollars, but I didn't get it full price I got it on sale plus I used my cash rewards um, like points no not really points but I did get a discount from my cash bag website which is cash rewards so I didn't pay full price which is actually a very smart move and yeah I have a note in here please don't mind it and yeah <clears throat> just a little bit of a feature the box looks substantial it looks expensive and yeah so this particular mule or loafer or shoe whatever you want to call it has this very shiny leather I believe it's calfskin not sure exactly sure about the leather but it is a very sturdy one they do have it in a little bit more softer but I didn't like that I, that one would not hold up pretty well but this one has held up pretty pretty good and it has that horse bit design which is very very classic and um, yeah a staple design and it has that like diagonal thing there so it doesn't have the full backing here so it's like a, it's a loafer and this one, I got it resold. Sorry if it's dingy, but yeah, I got that resold because um, it's quite the the heel is quite thin, and I think to for it to be and guys, actually, this is a women's low um, it's a women's shoe, so I got it in a bigger size, of course. And this one, I got it resold because the heel there. Is quite thin and for it to be a little bit more masculine I had it resold so the heel is a little bit higher than usual and also for it to, to last longer I didn't want it to go further into that leather sole and yeah mine is in size nine and a half and I'm men's eight just for reference if you're looking into buying this and yeah going through the pros of the shoe this one is very comfy guys if you don't want to like fuzz or you don't want to think about it and just beat and go out the door this is a very very good shoe it pretty much goes with everything but i think if you wear this on winter you might that's not probably a good idea but they do actually have it in the fur with the fur i'll insert uh take uh what's it take away no not take away please take say take away no it's <clears throat> yeah I'll insert a photo of it and the price guys it's not terribly bad it's almost like a hundred dollars and yeah I think for the price it's pretty good it's actually um, it's like halted the urge to buy the real one the, the Gucci one but I still do like the Gucci uh, mules with the fur is I'm dying to get that bit actually and because this is like a dupe or 
whatever you want to call it. <clears throat> it is a good way on trying out if you would like to buy into the brand or into that trend. And yeah, I think if you try this one, you might not want to get the Gucci one because this exact, it's like an exact um, same shoe, but it's just some difference in there inside. But um, a con of this is that it might, you might struggle a little bit to like get your feet in and keep your feet in. But sometimes I, my feet like, slips out of it and it there's one time I tried it on but I was in a hurry that's my fault I put my shoe on but I'm in a hurry I ran the shoe basically f fell out of my feet and when I put my feet on straight away it went in and that's like the excruciating thing ever <laughs> it's so so painful so the wear and tear that I've seen so far is decreasing in here on both of the, the shoe and the scuffs that are at the point there but to keep in mind if you're paying about more than a thousand dollars for this particular shoe and I mean the Gucci one and for me I don't know what to feel about it if this gets scuffed and I have the Gucci one I, f I will probably feel so bad but basically it's a shoe you have to use it guys and just that's just one thing to keep in mind if you're okay with that then go for it but I still on I'm still on that mindset of like paying a thousand dollars for a shoe but I think it's not too bad for a shoe if you're gonna use it and if you love it then go for it and yeah the Gucci one has the gold horse bit metal there but this is in the silver which I like I hope they do have it in the silver please let me know if you if it comes with the silver one but I, guys I do highly recommend doing what I did or like trying out a style if you're not sure about it because it's I think it's a smart way of like saving money if that makes sense um, but yeah I'll I think that's all that I have left um, for today I would like to see you on my next video guys please uh, like this video if you do enjoy it um, subscribe to my channel and follow me on my Instagram and I'll see you guys on my next one yeah, bye.